so hello everybody good day good morning good afternoon good evening or good night to you and thanks so much for joining me here today I wanted to say a special thank you to each and every one of you that watches my videos every week or every time I post because yeah all you know all you know I do be posting every week but you know it's you know a little week and a half little two weeks something whatever depending on when I get a chance to so I thank you all so much for joining in every time and I want to especially thank Miss zero seven sasha would have been my 500 subscriber you know big up to you and you know i have some sweet treats for you coming later on all right so really and truly tonight i wanted to um set up this unicorn light i'm not sure if you saw it properly but yeah this is super cute i just like unicorns or whatever um but you have to paint it so i said well while it is a painting it i could always chat about well myself you know because i did do a video initially when it is i was doing my vlog tober last year about getting to know me but we've come quite away from those creamy eyebrows you know <laughs> at that point i didn't have any mirrors to use and now i have a mirror but i'm thinking i probably didn't think this through because i'm going to paint and i'm wearing good clothes but anyway i digress so let me just open this up and we can start oh oh gosh isn't it cute oh i don't know how to do this <laughs> it's so cute oh my god look at this tiny precious little lamp wow oh man i am afraid i messed this up you know i like to think for some strange reason that i am an artist but i am not an artist my sister is the artist like she's legitimately an artist i am um, I paint things I start it and then I don't finish <laughs> or take forever to finish oh look at this in this box I have the what's in unicorn colors oh my gosh oh this is the instructions and they say before you start painting lay down a protective covering well let me not even bother to read the rest so before I get into it, let me say welcome to you. And if you don't know me, I am Julia Main. You know, that is my name or part of it. And I do vlogs, you know, I basically just kind of like showcase little pieces of my life and things I like to do. Now, you would realize that, you know, in between all the random things, there are certain themes here. So I do enjoy like kind of fitness, specifically running. Um, but that's really funny because I never actually was a proper runner like I I was always coming last in school and stuff like that But anyway, I did get into running while teaching myself how to run and I feel this is going to be a disaster Because these little tubes are so hard to open already and I am in my good clothes but let me see if I can open this while I'm talking to you all so how I really got into running I just kind of it it was actually a promise i made to myself all these years from since primary school to now that i was going to be able to run because i always used to reach last in primary school whenever we had our races and i went to a sporty primary school so that actually kind of segues into how i ended up on youtube in the first place so i used to make little videos of my runs and when it is we go to races my god there was a period in time where i was doing races like at least once a weekend and so I used to make little cute little videos on it and Sumobu kind of encouraged me to put videos up on that but um, that was a serious challenge it had a lot of heartbreak there so so uh, I ended up um, kind of pivoting um, I feel kind of like I did prove to myself that I would be that I could be consistent if I wanted to and if I really put my mind to it so to be very honest at this point I feel like I did accomplish my goal so I am pretty satisfied with <laughs> whatever comes right now now um, I know sometimes people might ask for me to go certain places like to the market and all these kind of things and I mean granted yeah maybe I may go but that's just not something that I do normally I saw somebody commented and asked if it is I would be on some doubles some doubles run now you all know my boo loves doubles 
and he loves to talk about doubles but funny enough you would not guess i don't really eat doubles <laughs> i really don't eat doubles at all why because um i had a really bad reaction to doubles now my dad used to buy doubles for us as children all the time so we see doubles all the time so uh, once um when it is he was picking up my sister in university we all went i was still in secondary school and i got a really really bad reaction to the doubles and i got sick for like many many months um you know it was a really bad experience and after that i just you know i should put my phone on silent excuse me it's so rude yeah so after that um i just didn't bother to eat doubles again it was a really bad harrowing experience so that's why you won't really see me um taste testing doubles or any kind of thing like that i am way too afraid i get a bad reaction again y'all i might finish this get to know me before i even finish the flower on this unicorn but anyway i'm pushing through it i am doing my studies i am also working so it'll be a lot of juggle like doing work because working full time trying to put out videos at least bi-weekly you know every week week and a half or whatever whenever i can and also trying trying and kind of failing to focus on my studies even though i am passing my exams and i am very grateful to god for that but um i really need to be more serious now you may see me on this channel be very um how do i put this i i probably come across as extremely you know quirky and bright and bubbly and all kind of thing and yes that is part of me but more than likely if it is anybody meets me in person the first thing they'll notice is i am very serious <laughs> i'm actually a very serious person you know don't let my high-pitched voice and you know some of my antics on these things fool you um i have to really get comfortable with people before I really unleash unleash all my personality so all the fets and everything that I go to all the parties or whatever it is I am attending it's because I actually just really like music right that is really the draw I am not um, like a party girl or any kind of thing like that I just really like music and where can we find that you know in a fet things like that i do enjoy like freeing up myself i just don't like being bored i like to do things right i can't just sit down and do nothing so i am very kind of activity focused so hence to why i guess maybe you know i enjoy doing the races and you know doing all those little kind of things because it's is activity i mean i'm kind of lazy but I do like to not be bored yeah and next thing about me like realize is I just really like to dress up um, I don't really go overboard or anything like that but you see you know just looking cute um, finding a nice outfit you know dressing up a little bit to go out I, I don't know I just enjoy that I think most women like that I need to get a container with water to wash this brush so let me come back in a second So we're back i got a little bit of water to clean my brush anyway so yeah um i enjoy basically dressing up i like changing up my hair um it's super fun you know i get these different looks and it makes life a little bit more interesting give me a little bit more pizzazz in my life you know sometimes i try to make my life interesting yeah so that's about that but i don't know if this really has anything to do with it but like even my first job my very first job working i was still in secondary school but it was like a vacation from i think form five to form six or something like that and so i ended up getting my first job working in westport i don't know if you all remember westport remember that it had westport and catwalk yeah that clothing store so my first job was in westport and i just kind of ended up doing retail a little bit after that and in working in retail i was even able to be like backstage at one of the miss universe competitions so you know helping out the ladies dress and stuff like that 
and then later on in life um, I ended up getting introduced to modeling because honestly I really just wanted to learn to walk in heels like, I never knew how to walk in heels and I thought it looked so elegant and whatnot but I was always wearing sneakers and slippers and <laughs> normal shoes and thing so I went to learn that and kind of just ended up falling into modeling you know what I mean you know like this color I find this color really cute like this kind of teal I really like it anyway so that was a very interesting time in my life let me put it like that because you know as I said with my personality I'm very quiet you still have to go to band launches and stuff like that I know you had to do what you had to do you know you have to sell the costume and that was kind of interesting in the sense of you know you had to be basically the opposite of very quiet I I worked on it you know you think about it like a job which it was basically then after I finished my degree because um, I did a degree and I went on to do a master's and in my master's I actually did my thesis on the fashion industry in Trinidad and Tobago so to be fair um, I've been interested in fashion and all these things for quite some time so possibly you know that's how now I just really like to dress up and also with you know the promise to myself that I was going to teach myself to run that's how come now I just try to stay fit I was very kind of unfit <laughs> very unfit as a child and as a teen and stuff like that so I guess I just kind of try to make up for it later on yeah so I really thought this would have been longer but I think that's all I need to share at this point in time <laughs> yeah you know just the contrast between what you might see in a video and what you might you know experience in real life however I really enjoy being silly and fun and I just like doing things and activity you know we all multi-dimensional here you know still waters run deep in this place so if it is y'all actually wanted to find out anything else about me you can put it in the comments at some point in time you know later on I can always do another one maybe like a get ready with me or something where it is I speak about the questions or something maybe not another getting to know me because how much time is you gonna get to know me you know and you get to know me basically every week when I post a video each time you know that is kind of like a me so <laughs> I don't need to do too much but if you do want to find out anything you can post it in the comments I do enjoy reading comments you know I don't get a chance to do that that often but when it is I do I enjoy it yeah I forgot to mention I'm also actually a very kind of private person which is also contradictory to what it is I'm doing here on YouTube all right y'all so that's it for getting to know me at this point I really was hoping I would have been able to finish Miss Unicorn here but I'm gonna have to continue painting her oh and I got triple A batteries but because I didn't even realize she needed batteries she needs batteries I went in super farm and I bought batteries and it looks like I'm not going to use it you know what I want to see what she looks like though but mm, let me finish paint it and maybe if I get to finish paint it before I post this video, I'll just put up a little picture of what she looks like. Is she so cute? Yeah, so I do. I like cute stuff too. So thank you guys so much for joining me and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.